Hey guys, it's Marcus. Welcome back to part two on how to make a factory game in Scratch. As you guys can see, I have my game pulled up and I'm going to zoom in a little bit so you guys can see better. And um, this is what we have so far. So if we click it, it doesn't really work. Now, I don't know why it does not work, because it should work. So, if you guys have this problem, then follow along with me. First, I'm going to make a blank, um, a blank sprite, and just add a comment, and say, this is blank. And then scratch 3.0. Just like that. So, we're just going to call this a blank. So, this will make the game run faster, but it's not really going to fix this problem. So, that's why we need to put... Um, First, I'm just going to take this out and put it over here. So if mouse down, then, so that works. But now if we set our cache to zero, Oh wait, that just fixes everything. So, I'm going to set it back to 10. So, that actually doesn't fix it, because... As you can see, uh, yeah, so, so we really don't need this one, so we can take that out. If cash is greater than nine, you can say, then that's good, but we need to actually put this over here and we put the mouse down last so I don't really know how to fix these problems but I assume this is how to do it so <clears throat> let's test this out So, yeah, as you can see, that just worked, and now it is not that bad. So, I don't really know what the problem was there, but we fixed it, so that's good. And now you can, uh, touch me. Wait. Oh, forgot to put this mouse down. So, this is the real test if this works. So, not over there. This is the real test. So, I'm just going to zoom out so I can put it in all right now I can zoom back in so now let's test this out so as you can see it doesn't really work 
So you need to click it a lot of times. If you click it once, it doesn't really work. So let's put this, uh, let's put this one at the top. Hmm. Let me, uh, try to do something else. I'm going to make a blog for this and call it, uh, Printer, um, yes, slash no. So, in this uh, define printer, we are going to put this in a forever loop and then put it there. So, then we are going to put our printer yes no right there so let's test that out that fixes everything there so now um yeah you have a good game and that already took six minutes but we still have time so what i want to do is make another one of these so I'm just gonna duplicate this. Actually, I'm just going to make a new sprite and call it Candy Machine. So then I'm gonna take this costume and put it over to the Candy Machine. Candy Machine, and I'm going to change the text and make it 50 so um that should be good but now i need to um make our actual candy machine so let's see i'm going to make a red base actually i'll make a pink base Okay, so new square, just like that, and then I'm going to have a red square inside of it, just like that, and now I'm going to take this same pink and make our top. Just like that. And I will also duplicate this. So copy and paste. Turn it around. Just like that. Alright, and now we are going to put this on top. So now that we have our candy machine, we are going to move this over here. And we are going to now in the beginning, one green flag click, we are going to, well, let's see where this is over there. So we'll move this over here so one green flag click we want to go to 80 and negative 74 that will be different for you guys because i did not center mine as you can see so don't count on mine count on yours and we are going to show and then switch our costume to not bought and this is gonna be called bot. I think that's what it is over here. Oh yeah, it, it should be candy machine bot, but doesn't matter. So 
Just like that, let's look back over here. That's all we have. And now I'm going to pretty much do the same thing. So forever, if touching our mouse pointer, so where is that? Touching mouse pointer. Then we want to, uh, sorry for the background noise, by the way. Um, we are going to say candy machine and then this little thing, um, two, two, uh, let's see what we said here. Oh, yeah, got the money symbol, so two dollars, two dollars. Come on, why didn't it load? Come on. Alright, fine. Two dollar. We can't do anything. Oh, over here. Why was I doing it in the seconds? I don't know. Alright. So, two. And then per second. And then for 1.2 seconds, and then we want to, um, also grab an and and an equals to. So basically we're just copying the same thing as the other one. And we're going to do this many times. So, and our costume number equals one and just in case if you guys didn't know what a costume number is they're over here you can see this is our costume one and this is our costume two so i showed that in the last video but if you're not familiar with that then there you go and now we are also just going to duplicate this so actually what i'm going to do is i'm just going to put this into our um into our backpack so first i need to open it so you just click on the backpack as you can see i have a lot of things put it in the backpack just like that because we are going to need it many times so over here we're going to put that block and we're going to hide our backpack so we are going to do a couple of things. Here we are going to change to 49. And that's good. Now we also need to make a block and call it candy machine. And then yes slash no. And we are going to put that in our forever loop. And then put this over here. Then we are going to switch our costume to not printer bot. We're going to switch it to just our bot. And then change our money by negative 50. And change our money per second by 2. And we're going to change this uh, go to. Because we actually want it to go to... Um, Oh wait, yeah, I can't buy it, so I'm just gonna, I don't know what I was thinking, but I'm gonna set our cash to, I'll just do 100. So, just like that, goes over there, so now, as you can see, it goes up by 2, but we want to put it over here, so, we want to go to 15, and negative 126 so let's test this out so this is what we have we fixed that problem and you can see it goes up by one excuse me and we're gonna wait until this goes up you know what i'll just test that so you can see it doesn't um do anything when i click it so 
I'm just going to change the cache by uh, 50. Just like that, so you can see it still goes up. And now let's click this. There we go. And it goes up by 3 because this is going up by 1 and this is going up by 2. So I do want to fix the costume a little bit. So let's go do that. Just going to move this a little bit like that. All right, that is perfect as you can see. So that'll be it for this video. And I hope you guys enjoyed. But before I stop the video, I also want to move this over here so we have a little more space. So that is negative 14 and we'll just keep that the same we're just going to do negative 124 so it's off the ground nope negative 125 all right we have to do negative 126 yep all right so That'll have to do it for part two, and I'll see y'all in part three. Peace.